more time at home in the era of social distancing and self isolation we have got a lot more time for reading we all love to read romantic novels that are written by foreign authors and we often forget novels that are written by our indian authors so in this video i will be recommending my favorite romantic reads that are written by indian authors so my first recommendation is forget me not darling which is written by pankaj l pande and seriously guys i am in love with this book this book is full of hope romance optimism and little bit of comedy so if you are looking for some kind of book that will restore your faith in like hope and old love then you should read this book this book is about two people those who are in madly in love with each other they are college going students but a tragic incident separates them later on how they overcome all the obstacles and then they decide to get united this is really very wonderful story and i think guys you should really read this book because if you have gone through some bad experiences some severe breakup or some tragic incidents then then this book really will be very helpful for you all in restoring your faith in love and every positive thing and in the era of this quarantine period this book will really be very a good read era of corona virus when everything seems to be negative this book will be a very positive and cheerful read for you all so i think you can read this book my next recommendation will be all novels that are written by chetan bhagat like two states three mistakes of my life revolution 2020 these books are like all revolves around relationship love sex and all these things which are common for everyone nowadays so uh, if in case you want to uh, inculcate reading habits and you are a beginner then chetan bhagat novels are really a good novels for starting and because they contain very simple english and their characters are also very relatable you can relate all the characters from your real life so i will suggest that you can start up with the a uh, few novels like half girlfriend uh, three mistakes of my life two states because uh, movies also has been made out of these uh, novels so uh, it would be really helpful for you all to understand so this will be my next recommendation will be life is what you make it that is written by preeti shrinoy although it is not a simple romantic love story it has other aspects also like uh, a girl named ankita she is very beautiful she is very charming and she is pursuing mba there are lot of guys those who are running after her but uh, a incident comes up in her life and she ends up into asylum she is quite depressed she is facing a severe anxiety and depression disorder so in this book it has been told ki how you can come overcome depression like what all things you need to do in order to beat and overcome depression so this book is really very good book in case if you want to read book that covers uh, other aspects like depression and all and if you are feeling little bit low then i'll suggest that you must pick this book this book is written by preeti shinoy and there are many things like uh, it has been told that you can uh, do physical exercises you can cultivate habit of uh, pursuing any kind of hobbies and uh, you need to smile and overcome all your thoughts in order to beat depression so these are the things which has been very nicely explained in this book so this book is really my very close to my heart because Uh, like other books they have already only covered few aspects like love and other things but real in real life it's not that that love is always uh, fruitful love is always successful sometimes it ends up with bad consequences like breakup and all so in order to deal with all these things how you can come up with depression and overcome all these bad feelings these has been very nicely stated in this book so i will recommend this book to you all so grab this book and read 
this book. As you all know that Ruskin Bond is my favorite author and uh, mainly he writes for children and he writes for children stories but uh, he has written many beautiful and magical love stories also. So uh, there are many short stories which you can read and my favorite uh, love story is like Time Stops at Shamli and Love and Cricket and uh, there are other beautiful uh, stories which are uh, written by him so you can uh, read Ruskin Bond books also they are written in very beautiful language and you will feel that you will be getting transported into a very beautiful world of uh, hills, river and forest, greenery and nowadays we are sitting at home and getting bored so it's a very good time for uh, us to um, explore hill station while sitting at our own place so you can read his book so my next recommendation is anything for you ma'am which is written by Tushar Raheja and it is a very light romantic comedy read so if you want to laugh out hard and loud then you should read this book this book is really filled with many comedic and uh, humorous incident uh, a guy who studies at IIT Delhi falls in love with a girl named Shreya and she is very cute and beautiful girl and there is a problem that they are into a long distance relationship and the guy desperately wants to meet that girl so what all ch challenges and uh, problems obstacles he faces in his life to meet her that are given into a very comedy way and there is a lot of Bollywood tarka in this book. So I feel that this book was little bit underrated and uh, there were few people, so only those who have read this book. So in case if you want to read a good book, uh, romantic book, light comedies, rom-com sort of, then please go for this book. The story of uh, long distance marriage written by Siddhesh Inamdar and this book is a really very beautiful book. In this book the concept of long distance marriage has been told like Rohan and Ira has been married and 15 months has been over um, from the point they are together but later on Ira decides that she wants to pursue for higher education and for that she needs to leave. So. Uh, to other country and then Rohan is all alone and how they make their long distance marriage to work so if people are those who are in long distance marriage they can read this book and those who are not in long distance marriage they can also read this book uh, because uh, they tells this book tells ki no matter what if a people two people love each other then distance are not a reason which will uh, lead them to separation they will uh, distance will become a reason uh, while they will love each other harder so you should read this book and this is written by an Indian author and it is really very beautiful read so you can grab this book favorite love story is a soldier's love story and uh, in this book there is an army officer named Ranjit and his parents wants him to get married with a uh, village girl named Jasleen. Jasleen has a very uh, bad past, very dreadful past and how they got married and afterwards they get separated because Jasleen wants to get pursue his career and uh, whereas Ranjit wants to uh, be an army officer and he gets posted into a field area so how afterwards destiny brings them together and both of them had a very bad past so how they cope help each other to cope up with them and how they fall in love so I love this love story because this love story was quite imperfect in the beginning but at the end everything seems to be very good so my idea of true love is no matter what problems are there in real life, what all people will uh, stand in front of you in real life, what all obstacles you, you both will face. But if your love is true and if you both want to be together, then you both will, um, you both will overcome all the problems and no matter what 
the problems all are you will come up with solution and you will always find a reason to hold each other hands and to be with each other otherwise you will find up we will come up with a different excuse so these are my favorite love story next one will be last but not the least that is uh, can love happen twice and i too had a love story which is written by ravindra singh if you want to uh, read a good love story then you can read this one also so uh, this were my favorite romantic uh, books which i love to read and do comment ki which all are your favorite romantic reads and what is your idea of falling into true love so i'm signing off thank you and have a very wonderful day thanks for listening me i hope you will enjoy reading all these books thank you and have a very wonderful day